pity for Red Bull because they've looked like solid top 10 contenders yet again here, haven't they, uh, in terms of raw pace, but a lot of work to do. What you do want to be here is uh, with an odd number on the grid because that's the right-hand side, and I think it'll be a hungry proportions of slipperiness on the left-hand side of the grid for the even starting numbers. And it's a short run down to the first corner too. On board with Robert Dornbos, the Dutchman from Rotterdam, who recently drove in his hometown, did a demonstration run, donuts and what have you, in the city centre, in the Minardi. A huge crowd turning out to see that, over 30,000 people. The Dutch do like their Formula One, and they've got two drivers in this Minardi team. It's 2-0 to teammate Christian Albers at the moment, as Dornbos makes a little mistake there into uh, turn seven. But uh, Dornbos has been the quicker of the two Minardi drivers throughout free practice. This is eight on board. It's all done in uh, one short of top gear, depending whether you've got six or seven speed gearbox. It's unbelievable when you stand there. It looks such a tight corner. They're taking it, most of them, in sixth gear. Down to turn nine. It's very wide as they try to create an overtaking place, but I think it'll be too dirty on the inside to make anything work particularly well there. And then the quick right-hander at the back of the pit. That is really a nothing for the driver, despite it being a couple of hundred miles an hour. He's six seconds down on clean. How can that be? Well, we've seen a few lockups. The car clearly isn't enjoying this wrist ride on this lap. We've seen it also with Dornbos as well in the last couple of Grand Prix. He's looked very strong through free practice, and in fact, he's ditched this lap. He's uh, coming into the uh, pits, as you can see, so he's not even going to complete the lap. And that's why. There's, uh, is that dust or is that a lot of smoke coming out of the engine? It's a lot of smoke. Was it brake? Uh, something on the right rear has gone. His right rear brake. Both his brakes are on fire, almost as if they haven't taken the blanking off his. Uh, or, or it's, it, it's like his rear brake ducts are just absolutely not functioning at all because the rears are, take a lot less energy than the front brakes. So, quite clearly, a fundamental. Either they're not on there or they're blocked up. 